If you are watching this, then you are about to find out. What is this channel about? If you are still here and didn't get lost back there, follow me. Ripley, Aliens 1986. Uh, upon my discovery of Kyber.ai, a uh, video generative tool, the first thing that I wanted to try was make something with Ridley Scott's alien theme. Fascinated by this sci-fi growing up. For me in this genre, Aliens is second to none. Went to sleep. The next day, I checked the video, and it had about 1,200 views. So for someone who has never seen more than 20 to 30 views on anything they shared, it can change something inside your head. I wouldn't call it an opportune thought, but more like an insane thought to dive into complete insanity voluntarily. And, and from that began my journey into the generative uh, AI in the beginning prior to Aliens video. I experimented with the tech uh, to make intros for friends, myself, and some videos for games like No Man's Sky. But nothing posed a real challenge when it came to aliens. Almost getting frustrated with how the xenomorphs looked in the beginning and the tech still evolving. I worked with what I had, but not satisfied at all. Kept looking and finding ways to create the authentic look. At this point, I wasn't even thinking of making short stories, but just to get the look right. Um, then I stumbled upon the tool. In Hamburg, Germany, a mad physicist in search for true passion, and in good old USA, a guy who just wants to make great looking aliens. Uh, the mad physicist looks at deforum generative power and says to himself, I wonder if uh, I can make this tech available to a regular person and see what they would do with it. So he used his madness and made it into a tool that can chain the deforum beast, calls it neural frames, and boom, futuretools.io. Um, listed on their site where all the AI junkies kept watch like traders in the stock market. What is the hottest thing we can use to translate our nightmares, our daydreams into a visual? I still remember the day I stumbled upon neural frames because as soon as I started my first render in it, I knew this is it and the rest is history. Nikolai Klemke, the mad physicist, harnessed the immense power of deformed stable diffusion into a web-based user interface which mimics a video editor. As a creator, I can watch my renders frame by frame, stop the render and start it, crafting fine-tuned motions. The possibilities are endless. The rest of the video will showcase my finesse, polishing the alien's look for my content. I congratulate you if you have watched the video this far. Kudos to you, viewer. Thank you. 